Shocking pictures emerged of children in Gaza brandishing weapons as thousands of people took to the streets celebrating the ceasefire between Israel and Hamas last week. Over half of Gaza's 1.7 million residents are under the age of 18 and grow up surrounded by strong local culture of armed struggle against Israel. Kay Parkinson introduces us to a group that's trying to encourage Gaza's children to choose a more peaceful way. From a small studio in Gaza, a group of young Palestinian men are taking their message of peace to the streets. Camp Breakers are Gaza's first breakdancing crew, bringing breakbeats and hip-hop style from the rough-and-tough streets of New York to the rough-and-tough streets of the Gaza Strip. Their aim, to show Gaza's children that there is something other than violence. There is a people who, who are a professional in the resistance, and the real resi resistance with the weapons and guns. I want to say you can choose your way to resistance, not just guns. There is a lot of other ways to, to the resistance. Like uh, you can use uh, your art, you can use the internet, you can use the pen. Gaza is deeply conservative and Western pop culture is largely shunned by the Islamist Hamas leaders, but you wouldn't know that from watching this. Using break dance to break down boundaries, their workshops are popular. In a society struggling under an Israeli blockade and where life moves fluidly between states of semi-peace and semi-war, dance is a welcome distraction. I would say to any Palestinian children that they should come here. Anyone who is interested in dancing should come here and learn how to use their energy in a positive way and learn how to interact with others and learn the dance moves. The group wants to compete internationally, but the blockade makes traveling difficult. And so for now, camp breakers are happy performing here and giving Gaza's war children hope for their future. Kate Parkinson, CCTV, Gaza.